Welcome to Big Smile Reviews. So as soon as the DSi comes out, Nintendo fans have been begging Nintendo for some huge update for the DSiWare. And now it's that time Nintendo hit us hard with a humongous update. And this is not even a game, it's an art application. Let's check it out. So Flipnote Studio is all about making your own animations. It's using these very simple tools to make animations. Let's have a look at this. Here's a drop. Next page. The drop moves a little lower. And again, I'm really rushing this, so please don't laugh at my art. And again, and then the drop falls down. And squishes even lower. Now let's check out this little art. There we go. You see that? So now let's have a look at this one more time. You, ha you get a blank page where you can draw anything you want. A stick man, for example. And it's pretty easy to draw with the stylus. Then on the top, you have all these functions. So here, if you press up on the D-pad, you get the menu screen. And here you get the, all the different draw drawing tools. So for example, you see the different pencil tools you have. You can use this tool. Then you have the paint tools. You see all kinds of patterns you have. There we go. And this will help you make really nice, uh, different arts, different nice animations. Now when you make your first picture, you press uh, forward on the D-pad and you move to the next page. And you see, you, you see a faint outline of the first picture, so you know where to draw your next one. And you just move it a little bit forward if you want your figure to move. Then again, you move forward, and again, you move just a little bit forward. And you see, you, you kind of draw his hands and legs in different uh, positions to make him look like he's moving. And you see, you can keep on doing this and so on. Then, once you have your animation ready, you press down on the D-pad, and you see your animation comes to life. You see, the beauty of flipping out is using these extremely simple tools to make these animations. So let's have a look at these tools in more detail. You have your picture up here. Well, this we had a look at this. Now let's have a look at this, for example. You see, you can copy your one animation from another. Let's have a look. Let's say you, you want to take this stickman up here and you want to copy it onto a different page. Because you don't want to redraw this uh, page and you copy it onto this page, you see? Now another really cool feature here, here is the select feature. Let's say you drew something and you don't want to redraw that part again and you want to use it in another uh, note, in another, in, on another picture. So you select that part, then you copy it. You see this, the part gets copied. And then you go to the page where you want to insert that little picture and you press paste. And you see, this is the part you selected from the previous picture, and you can paste this anywhere you want on the screen. Let's say right here. Press the A button, and there it is. Let's say you want to paste it here as well. And there we go, you see? In addition, you also have these simple tools like undo. You have tools like shrink your image. So up here you see your, your image, and you can shrink it. Then you can bring it back. You have a flip, for example, so you can flip it to the other side. And again, very, very simple tools. For example, you have a tool where you can use your pictures that you have stored on your DSi. You can have these pictures and you can make animations with these pictures as well. But you see, you have to remember that it's really limited on colors. This is something that they could have added. There's really only three colors in the whole game. And this is a little bit of a letdown. You see right here, you have black, blue, and red. They really should have added more colors. That's one minus. And because of that, the pictures that you have, you see, the, 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 they're not going to look very nice, you see. Th that's a little bit of a minus, I do agree. However, it's still a really nice feature. And another cool feature I want to show you here is the sound feature. Once you made your animation, you can add sound to it. So you can add music and it records it. Or you can add little short individual sounds which you can add to an individual frame. Hello. You play animation and then you select where you want to add that individual sound. So let's play it. 
and you see he's gonna say hello wherever you click the, the hello button and you can add a, the three different sounds so those were the dead basics of flip note studio there's so much to this and the beauty of it is the creativity that lets you have with such basic features you can create amazing stuff amazing stuff let's check out some like my own creations once you created a few animations you can have a look at them let's check out here we have a list of different animations let's check out uh, this one this is my first animation that I made check this out look at that Sonic running around beautiful we see that whole loop right here we see a cloud we see a little bit of mountains very simple let's check out this one right here little stick man jumping into the wall trying to break open the wall this is the multi-lock animation it's very popular and it's beautiful if you do it right it can be really funny and really really good fun now we can have a little bit of uh, more complicated animations these are from uh, nintendo themselves let's check out i don't know what this is okay some little flea thing going on here oh this is even scary this is a creepy animation okay <laughs> But anyway, you, when you take an animation, you can edit it, and you can add stuff to it if you want. And you see, we saw some really basic features that this flip note has. And with these very basic features, you can create some really, really good stuff. This right here is a flip note Hatana. This is the website where you upload all your flip note animations. This is like the YouTube of flip note. It is amazing and you have some fantastic stuff going on here. You can upload your own animation here once you created it. Look at this. Now remember all those simple features that we used? Look what an awesome beautiful work you can create with it. Look at that, fantastic. Now this is not easy, but you do have to be creative to do something like this. So it is completely up to you how simple you use this, or how complicated you want to make it. You can really do some amazing stuff here. Beautiful, look how cute it all is. Look at a beautiful story, beautiful music to it. There you go, that was the basics of the beautiful Flip Note Studio for the DSi. At last, Nintendo has given us the awesome power to be so crazy and creative. This is beautiful. You can create so much stuff here. You can make a green dude, you can make Sonic, Mario, Link, whatever you want, and upload it all online. Let me see your creations. Tell me what you made. Tell me what you think of this. Bye! Bow before your children.